We are Sorted, a group of mates from London exploring the newest and best in the world of food whilst trying to have a few laughs along the way. <laughs> we've got chefs, we've got normals, and a whole world of stuff for you to explore, but everything we do starts with you. Hello everyone, I'm Mike, this is Baz. Well, this is an impossible challenge. This is Pass It On Baking Edition. Surely that can't go wrong. What's everyone done? What is going on here? Oh no! <laughs> um... How are we feeling? That usual nervous excitement. I'm less excited than nervous. I've got no excitement, pure nervousness. Do we have a theme, Janice? Today's theme is baking. <laughs> That's just baking. Uh, you bake potatoes. And also... <laughs> no, not again! Not again! Remember, baking is not a science. Baking We're stood in a dangerous order at the moment, but has Janice got a proper order? The order is shoe size, smallest to tallest. <laughs> for those of you with the same shoe size, the tallest will go first. I'm wearing shoes that are too big for me today. <laughs> <laughs> you put daddy's shoes on again. <laughs> tallest. And then, and then taller. Oh, oh no! no! The worst thing is that I'm going to spend all this time decorating it, making sure we got a, a fully finished product. And he's going to eat it. He's just going <laughs> to... One at a time, the boys have 10 minutes to cook and add to a final dish. The remaining team will have no idea what's happening behind them until it is their turn. Okay, baking could mean so many different things. It's obviously going to be sweet, but I'm concerned in 15 minutes of making a cake, baking a cake, cooling a cake, and then trying to layer it with some kind of frosting or icing or filling or ganache. It's just not going to work with hot cake. So I'm going to make a hot cake, and therefore it can be served hot with custard, with creams, with other baked fruits. There's so many other things we can bake. So I'm going for like a frangipani kind of thing. Butter, melted. Same amount of butter as sugar, and same amount of sugar as ground almond, and then half as much flour. Four eggs. What should we flavour it with? That's our choice. Vanilla, obvious, but I think also some citrus in there, either lemon or orange. Obviously, I could cook this in any size, and if I do this size, then hopefully they can turn them out and they can be cooked quickly, but at the same time, look nice on the plate without Jamie, who's going last, having to do too much to shape it. Now, the big question. Do we want something in the bottom? I think maybe some fruit, so when you turn it out, it could be quite nice. I also want to leave some clues of what else could be done so they don't moan. Maybe some baked apples, some baked fruit. We've got the orange, we've got the vanilla. We've got this crystallised ginger and some walnuts. They're simple flavours that can have so many things added to them. So they're going on the bottom, and then basically when the cake turns out, obviously they'll be on the top. Two minutes. An oven at, is at 180, because that's what all cakes are cooked at. <laughs> Into the oven. 15 minutes, done. Clues for Barry. I'm not going to add anything more in these final seconds, but I am going to say, I've hinted at baked apples, I'm going to hint even more by taking the tops off of them and implying that something needs to come out of that, because then it will bake in enough time, he can fill it, he can season it with all sorts of different things. I'm literally filling time for two, one, I'm done. And I'd probably give myself about an eight out of ten. Bold, I know. I'm more scared of this one than any other one we've done. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. Do I have to do this? Oh, I started! Okay, um, so, let's have a look. Let's have a look. What are they? I'm not sure I should open the door because they might, they might sink. Right, I can't do it. I can't do anything to that. What can I make? What can I make? How long have I got? I've got eight minutes. I'm just flapping. So what can I make? What can I make? What can I make? What can I make? Can I make? Can I make honeycomb? 10, 20, 30 minutes a set? Yeah, honeycomb. Holy, what am I doing? What am I doing? This is sucks. Okay, on. How much do I need? How much do I need? Stupid idea. Stupid idea, Barry. That'll do. This is a bad idea. Oh, I'm panicking so much. Why well, am I using this spoon? This is a bad idea. Oh, I forgot everything. Okay, let me double that. Grams, go. What have I been measuring in? Oh, I measured it with the wrong, wrong measurements. Oh no! I've been measuring in ounces, not grams. Crap! Crap! Right! Ah! Oh, why have I done this? They can hate me. Oh, oh no. 
Into the pan, go, 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 go. Oh, I need the main thing that makes honeycomb, bicarbonate of soda. Do we have any bicarb? Please say we've got bicarb, otherwise I'm screwed. <laughs> Ah, oh, why is what's this about? I'll I'll do some tidying up and just. Kids, I think I have done awful. I'm going to give myself a solid two. And I think you know what? I think that's generous. <sighs> Hello everyone. What is going on here? <laughs> What's this? this hasn't got this in it already, has it? Okay, there's some orange, some walnuts, and some ginger. Who put what where? And why is, what is that? Maybe I could just chill for 10 minutes. They're gonna need something to put on top of the cakes. We probably want a little drizzle, so I'll make a little drizzle. Hopefully I can get the caramel done before Mike comes because he will panic and not do it. Has that already got soda in it? Izzy's like, Izzy's laughing her head off, so it might actually already have it in it. And if it does, then I should probably start it again. <sighs> Barry, Barry, Barry. That's definitely got soda in it. I'm making a drizzle to go on the, like an icing sugar drizzle to go on the cakes once they're out. Hopefully they'll cool in time. This is just orange. And I might put some ginger through it as well. I think Mike will definitely try to add something, which is not always the best idea, you know? The ideal situation in a Pass It On is if Jamie doesn't have to do anything. I'm gonna put ginger into that. I know there's baking soda in it already. I know it is. It looks like, oh, it looks okay, but honeycomb can look okay and then it can sink and be awful, so we'll see. I think if that's gonna set in time, it's probably gonna need to be chilled, but I can't do anything with it right now. It's gotta set up a little bit and then it could go in the fridge but I'm gonna have to rely on Mike to do that. Faster these, cool, the better. Oh my God, I'm done. I'll give myself a seven. Still not comfortable though. Hey. Right. Oh, what the hell is that? Oh, that, I think that's honeycomb. These look, what flavor is that? Oh, I'm really worried about this. That's not gonna set in time. You can't put honeycomb in the fridge, can you? There isn't really anything to add. I haven't got, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do with that. What are we doing with that? We're hiding these. I'm just gonna chop stuff. I'm gonna make a sweetened cream and just leave it there and see what he does with it. Right, double cream. I'm only gonna put a tiny bit of icing sugar because we don't want it too sweet. Oh, I'll tell you what I could do. I could use some of that vanilla that's there. Or I could use Kahlua, which is a coffee liqueur. How long have I got? Oh man. Um, but I've got to find the Kahlua. Oh, do we even have any? If we don't have any, I'm using vanilla. I haven't really got time to look underneath there because it could be under there. I really want to find that. Nope. I'll just knock the set down. Oh! Ow! But I got it! Yeah, that's quite nice. There's a subtle hint of coffee, but not too overpowering. Lay that next to that really amazing thing that I did there. Oh no, how's he gonna know about the... Oh, I better put this back. I'm just gonna have to leave the honeycomb. I'm just done with leaving clues. He's just gonna have to look in the fridge. If he looks in the fridge, I'm gonna give myself a six, because Let's face it, I made some sweetened coffee cream. Now, if he doesn't look in the fridge, I'm gonna give myself a three because we've lost an entire component because of me. Oh, the guys fell over it. Last man standing. Boop. I have two ways of approaching this. I either come in, panic, miss some stuff, muck it up, or I take a really relaxed approach and just try and see what's going on. So we have some lovely dainty little cakes. That's got Ebba's written all over it. Cream and an empty oven. Is there anything else? And then he remembered the fridge. What am I missing? And Jamie remem- oh no, he's just going to eat stuff, isn't he? I'm not just hungry, I'm just trying to see what this is. And he's going to eat him, he's going to eat him, he's going to eat him, he's going to eat him. I spent three minutes eating things, that was fun. Um, <laughs> Look at that for a plate. It's made of wood and everything. Oh, 
kill me in the face. Do I cut one of those cakes in half, put the cream in the middle, so we make it into like a, a sandwich cake? Or oh, sandwich. That's a good idea. I could pipe that, couldn't I? I'm gonna pipe it just for bants. Found some candles. We're making cake, so we've, 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 baked, we've baked a cake, so why wouldn't you have, why wouldn't you have candles? Ta-da! There could be a nice way to do this, or there's the Jamie way to do this. Three guesses which one we're going for. Yep, he's Jamied it. Oh. This can't be it, Jamie thought, so he checked the fridge to see if he'd missed anything. I want to say better, but... Right, I'm going to maybe pour... <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> That's just not gonna work. No, stuff that. I don't know how to do a Quinell. Um, <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna get rinsed. Check the f fridge! <laughs> That's the most disappointing kid's birthday party cake I've ever seen. Ah! No. Oh no. What Amy. could possibly have happened after me? What, what is going on? What? There's the smoke coming out of it, Jamie. <laughs> Are you ready to see what we made? Well, yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. That's okay. the saddest thing I've ever seen. I mean, it's got a cherry on the top. Firstly, there was more than one in the oven. Are yeah, you... it's not like Jamie just to serve less than we. He's probably eaten so. the other three. <laughs> less is more. I ate one because less I, just, is I had more, to know. Less is more. <laughs> I had to know what it was. <laughs> yeah, well, I feel like you didn't look in the fridge. Why would I look in the fridge? Honeycomb. Cool. And so the sign to the fridge to say that the honeycomb was in there was. I thought I'd leave that up to your own initial. In in <laughs> Oh, well, let's eat it. Let's well, just eat this. Uh, I did have another attempt at plating and it didn't go well. That's better. That's, that's better. better. That's better. That's better. That's better, mate. That's what? Better. This is what you... <laughs> <That's> <laughs> less is more. Cheers. It's a nice cake. Mm. I like the cream, actually. Do you know what? With the... Crunch, Honey time, that would have been delicious. With mm. the crunch of the walnuts, you that don't need any other texture. No, you're right, actually. Yeah. <laughs> I have to be honest, I thought it might be too many flavours competing with each other, but actually the coffee cream is delicious with that. Oh. It's still crap though, isn't it? I don't think there's anything wrong with that. No. I think we were disappointed with the, how it was plated. No, you're absolutely right. Everything that's on the plate works well mm. and is an, a tasty mouthful. Uh, let's just go straight in. I'm going to say it's a pass because we've had far worse <laughs> fails. <laughs> I'm happy to say that's a good pass. Is it a pass? I, I can't decide. Mm. What's your heart telling you? My heart's saying, I'm, I'm, my heart's <laughs> saying I failed. <laughs> and, yeah. and you all failed with me. <laughs> I know you like to think that you're better than this, but after as many of these as we've done, maybe you're not. I don't think I'm better than this. <laughs> I, just, I just think I'm better than you. Does that say that? Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm going to have to say it's a fail. Oh. It tasted, it tasted good, just so close yet so far, we're borderline. I think if you eat that with your eyes shut, it's a beautiful pass. As it is, it's a pass. <laughs> okay. Okay, well, majority rules, guys, it's a pass. I'm putting it out there. Uh, I rated myself a six, but if the honeycomb didn't come out of the <laughs> fridge, it was a three, so I'm on a three. Oh, no. <laughs> so you predicted that the honeycomb wouldn't come out of the fridge. Yeah, I know so you why so did well. you not make it obvious that the honeycomb was in the fridge? Because number one, I ran out of time, and number two, I made that terrible error of <laughs> overestimating you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I ended up rating myself. Um, because well, that I, makes sense. I, I rated myself <laughs> a seven. I, I didn't know if That's ten was you? high. Two. 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 <laughs> Ebers. I went bold on this one with eight. I oh, think that's, oh, yeah. I think yeah. that's pretty good. I mean, I did the only thing part of the baking. I did the only baking part yeah, okay. of the baking. We, we said you deserved it. <laughs> <laughs> so please list us down below in order you think we came from well, best to worst. Best oh. to worst. Also, thank you so much for listing your themes and your orders. They're absolutely amazing. Keep them coming in because they literally make these videos. Otherwise, make sure you subscribe to Sorted Food. Click that red button, ring that bell, do all that jazz. Do the liking. And we'll see you in the next video. See you on Sunday, 4 p.m. As we mentioned, we don't just make top quality YouTube videos. No. 
we've built the Sorted Club, where we use the best things we've learned to create stuff that's hopefully interesting and useful to other food lovers. Check it out if you're interested. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in a few days. It's really hard being here on your own, just talking to yourself. Nobody's giving anything back, you know?